Hey guys, how is it going? This is Marcel here and today I'm going to show you how to create, download and play MapleStory 2. The first thing you have to do is go to maplestory2.nexon.com and you'll end up on our homepage. So on our homepage you just click game start. You then get a login prompt. And the small online text at the bottom right of the box is the sign up button. And you need to click it right there, just like I'm doing here on the video. The servers of this website are in Korea, so the site might take a while to load. Then you get this page. And at this page, you just check every box. It says you have to watch, subscribe, and give couple some money. But in Korean, so it's okay. It's okay. You, just, you can just click it. Right then you get on the next page and here you have to fill in your email address or you can be as lazy just as me and click on the Google Plus button because when you click the Google Plus button it will automatically link to your account so or you can just type in your email and do whatever you like you know if you don't have a Google Plus or you don't use it that's okay now I just want to say very quickly sorry for the quality of this video I'm recording with OBS and I don't know, there's something wrong, it seems it seems a bit odd. But anyway, I just verified my account on Google+, and it automatically made a username for me. But as you can see by the red dot underneath the username, I can't use it. So I'm gonna have to choose for another username. Sorry, there's the red line, I was speaking too fast. Um, but I went for Copper Sand, that one's already taken. I wonder by who, Ronald, I'm looking at you. And... What I did at the uh, password, I just filled in subscribe with a capital S and it worked. So I don't think there has to be, you know, if your password don't work, just try capitals or numbers. Uh, but there don't seem to be any rule for it right now. So you can use basically anything you like. So subscribe, subscribe, and then you press the blue button. Oh, wait, I forgot one thing. You also have to fill out your date of birth. Now most of you will know to fill out your date of birth correctly because if you want to recover your account or anything it's you know you need to have the correct date of birth so I made a mistake once in MapleStory Global in Europe and I couldn't get my account back because I filled just random numbers in so make sure to do it correctly and then you press the blue button right there okay and now it says we have signed up Hooray! Now you might get a confirmation link in your email, but I didn't get one. So if you get one, just click on the link. If you don't have one like me, it's very weird why they sent one to one and not to the other. But you know, it's okay. It doesn't really matter. So we're going on to step two. And step two is to download the game. So first thing you have to do is just log in on the website. And you have to use not your username, but your email address and your password. So marcel.schak at gmail.com and subscribe. Then you just log in. Again, it takes a while. Oh, I also recommend you doing this, by the way, in uh, Internet Explorer or Firefox, not in Google Chrome. Because in Google Chrome, there seemed to be a lot of issues. I had a lot of issues downloading it and logging in. It was just messed up. So use Internet Explorer or Firefox. And then again, you get to this page where you need to log in. So again, just fill in your email address, your password, subscribe, and the code at the bottom. I always suck at these codes, man. Then you press OK, the code changed. But that's okay, it works anyway. Okay, I want to save this password, yes. Okay, next up. You have now logged into the website and you want to download the game. Now you see this game start, this hexagon, and you're gonna press the yellow text that's in it, so the bottom side of the hexagon. And you then will be redirected to the download page. Hooray! We're getting close, people, we're getting close. So, next thing you have to do is you click download one. Not download two, download one. I don't know why, but apparently download 2 doesn't really work. So, again, excuse my OBS player, it isn't recording something very well, but anyway. Um, so you get, you click download 1, you get this. So then you tap the left box and also then press the orange button, which I'm gonna do right now. I said which I'm gonna do right now. Ah, there we go. It's hard working with myself. Alrighty, so then it will just... And also people, it's very important that you don't buy an account because if you do that and you play from another region except Korea, the Korean GMs will probably ban you. But yeah, when you press the right buttons, you'll get a download link at the bottom of your screen. And you'll just press it OK and then you get a setup file which makes you start the downloader. And the downloading took me about 5 hours. Seriously, because I live in Europe and the Korean servers are a bit far away, so it just took a while. But after the downloading is done, you just press the green button, it then says this. 
I just pressed OK, not sure what it did. So after you've clicked the green button, the installer will start. Now at first the installer didn't quite work for me, so I had to restart it from the map manually. And you can do this just by checking where they saved the file, so it's not that hard to find. If you have some trouble, it won't really start. It, it takes a while though, so just wait for 5 or 6 minutes. If it doesn't start then, you can just find it manually and just click it again and then it worked for me. Okay, and when the download is at 100%, don't click anything yet. For me the box closed itself and MapleStory 2 will launch itself eventually. So I got this super tutorial guide thanks to MapleStory2.tv, uh, Hidden Street posted the, the complete tutorial. Uh, I'll put a link in the video description for you so you can check it out. If you have any other questions regarding this, I suggest you post them on MapleStory2.tv because, well, that's the best place. That's where all the whole community is at. So when the download is completed, you will see this small bunny chick popping up at the right corner and that means maple story 2 is launching that's right and after that maple story 2 will just start oh glory i've waited so long for this so i want to say a huge thanks to hidden street and maple story 2.tv for posting the guide and yeah let's try it out shall we I'm still recording this by OBS by the way, so it might still be a bit, but that's just in this video. The game itself looks great. So right now you can only create your character and select the server you want to play in. Uh, the, the game itself won't start until the 7th of July, which is within a week. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm hoping to see you guys there. So right now we'll get a short tutorial about how you can customize your character and what you have to do. We already created a few videos about this, so you can check them out if you want to in the MapleStory 2 playlist. So right now, I'm starting the game people, I'm starting MapleStory 2. And if you want to, you can do too. So let me know if it works for you. This is my final character by the way, my name is Koppelsan M. Uh, I hope to see you guys in game and, and then we can play together. How awesome would that be? So let me guys know if it works for you and again, for the third time, thanks to MapleStory2.tv for the guide for the MapleStory2.tv user hidden street to be precise. Uh, thank you guys for watching and see you guys later. Bye bye.